15 Camping Tips for Beginners Camping is everyone's favorite pastime. Whether you're camping as a group or by yourself, it's the best possible way to leave the stress behind you, enjoy nature, and recharge your batteries. However, camping can also be a challenging hobby, especially for a beginner. That is why in this video, I introduced you easy and helpful camping tips for beginners. The list was put together after interviewing several experienced camping enthusiasts, as well as tips from my own camping experience and expertise. Some of the tips here may sound obvious, but each and every one of these is important and contributes for an amazing experience. With that said, I highly recommend that you visit our site and read the full article, where I list all 80 tips for a great, successful and enjoyable camping for everyone, and especially for beginners. Let's begin. 1. Start your camping trip with a checklist. Preparation for a camping can be an overwhelming endeavor, especially for a beginner. Making a thorough checklist can save you from a lot of headache. Make a list of the entire gear and food that you need to take with you. Fill your backpack according to this list. Write down your plans for the camping trips, where and when you are going, what you are planning to visit, and so on. Staying organized is the number one tip. For more information on organizing for a camping trip, visit our site and read our article about the essential camping checklist. 2. Bring only the most necessary items. Remember that you will probably need to carry everything that you pack. Choose carefully what's needed and what can be left at home. Don't overload yourself, otherwise the trip might turn into an unpleasant task. Even if you're camping as a family, don't bring more than you will use during the trip. Camping trips often last only a couple of days, so no need to pack your entire house. 3. Prepare for any situation. While the previous tip suggested to pack only what you need, you still need to be prepared for various situations. This could be something as basic as adding an extra pair of socks or another roll of toilet paper. You should also bring a first aid kit with your prescribed medications. Simply take a good look at what needs might arise on your trip, and pack accordingly. On our site you can find an article about the best first aid kits available and how to choose them. 4. Borrow camping equipment. If this is your first time, consider borrowing a few camping items from a friend. The very first camping experience should be about relaxing and absorbing the nature's energies. Therefore, don't invest too much money into your first camping trip. Just get a feel of this new adventure and don't rush buying every necessary gear yet. 5. Try a nearby camping site at first. If this is your first camping trip, you shouldn't go too far. Don't add a long drive to the list of tasks. As first-timer, you might find out that you forgot to pack something, or that the weather is not to your liking, or that you wish to leave the camping site earlier. Selecting a site near your home helps you get back much faster. 6. Explore different campsites. To keep this experience constantly fresh, visit different campsites. Don't get attached to just one preferred location. Explore more possibilities, find exciting new places. Other campsites can offer stunning views and interesting challenges, so don't be afraid stepping out of your comfort zone. You can use a website such as the National Park Service to find more parks and campsites to visit. 7. Pick a pleasant weather. A nasty weather can ruin any camping trip. In the spirit of not making the first trip too challenging, pick days with a guaranteed pleasant weather. Don't camp during stormy or cold seasons, but also don't choose the hot summer. Late spring or early fall are probably the best seasons in the Northern Hemisphere. 8. Bring chairs and a table. We usually take furniture for granted, but we will dearly miss it on a camping trip. If possible, get a small folding table and several chairs. You can still enjoy nature, but there is a positive side to having a spot where you can have your meals on a clean and even surface. Not sure what chair you need to get? Don't worry, I have this covered in my article on choosing the best camping chair. Visit our site and read our article about how to choose the best camping chairs. 9. Get a portable charger. Although I advised against bringing too much equipment on your camping trip, you will probably still pack your phone, a camera, and other essential tech. Unfortunately, there aren't any electrical outlets, although some campsites offer recharging stations. 
In any case, bringing a portable charger can make a huge difference once your devices run out of juice. You can use a reliable portable power station. I have an article on how to choose a power station for camping that you should take a look at. Read the article Best Portable Power Stations on our site for more information. 10. Equip yourself with sufficient lighting. The woods are dark, this should not be a surprise. You will need electric light to navigate next to the tent and inside of it. Pack a flashlight for every member of your group. If you're not sure what kind of flashlight you need to get, you can check my article on best camping flashlights. A headlight is also a convenient gadget that can help you rummaging in the backpack or reading before the sleep. You should probably have some sort of a lantern for the supper, although it might attract too many bugs. 11. Make use of plastic bags. Plastic bags can be your friends. You can use them repeatedly for a variety of purposes, wrapping everything to protect against moisture packing clothes that you've already worn and changed, to be washed later packing everything after you leave the campsite picking up trash to dispose of it afterwards. 12. Pitch the tent away from the trees. Pitching a tent under a tree can turn out to be one of the worst decisions ever. Not only will you have to constantly clean the tent from leaves and bird dropping, but there is also the constant danger of falling branches. A strong wind can cause a heavy branch to fall on your sleeping location, damaging your equipment. Trees are great to adore, not to sleep under them. 13. Pitch and set up camp during the day. Since setting up a camp can be a complicated task for a novice, you better do it during the daytime. Arrive early, while the sun is still up. Pitch the tent, set up the washing and eating areas, get to know your surroundings, and so on. Avoid doing all these important tasks in the dark, when they become less fun and more stressful. 14. Don't wear shoes inside the tent. For many experienced campers, no shoes inside the tent has become an actual awe. Shoes tend to drag mud, leaves, grass, moisture and bugs into the tent's interior. Your sleeping area should always be tidy and clean. Leave the dirty boots outside the tent. Instead, bring slippers to walk inside the tent, and never wear those slippers on the outside. 15. Protect your valuables. Never leave your valuables unattended. There is no way to know who may wander up to your campsite and steal your stuff. If you plan to hike for several hours, take the valuables in your backpack or pockets. If you had arrived at the campgrounds on bikes, don't forget to lock them before going for a walk. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to our channel for more videos about off-grid, mapping, survival and other interesting topics. For the full article, and more information about off-grid living, survival, camping, and much more, please visit our site and enjoy our articles on these and other topics. Have an amazing day!